bright cubers. I forgot my glasses, so I can't really see you, but don't tell anyone at UCL, but I'm actually here at Sheffield Student Union. I'm exploring the idea of distinctive community, hanging out with a Christian union, a guy called Isaac. It's all about getting outside the box and meeting new people, gathering a community, talking as it is. Enjoy the short film. Let's go. James. Hello, how's it going? Well, I got the camera on. My lecturer 12. You have a van. <laughs> I think we just lost a bunch of glass jars in the back. Yeah. Advice to anyone organising an events week. Glass jars look pretty at weddings. Not very practical. <laughs> Like this is quintessentially Isaac. So what's that at the back? It's a lake. Yes, no parking ticket. So we're heading back to uni. We back are. We were talking yesterday about death and resurrection of different organisations. Sometimes um, organisations die because they're just not being nourished and not being um, sort of kept alive. Mm. Um, but I think the nature of CUs is that they sort of fluctuate over time, that numbers go up and go down. About 130 people coming to meetings, I think. Again, the nature of CUs, things change each year, like you change leadership each year mm. and students only have a three year sort of cycle. Um, and each year the vision sort of changes about where you are at the moment in university and what your where you sort of want to see the students by the end of the year. If you want to see like hundreds of people come to know Jesus, that's obviously always the dream. Um, or whether you just want to sort of engage the entire campus in a conversation. Christianity is relevant, desirable and true. Um, and to try and share that with everyone on campus. Is, is Christianity relevant today? There we go. That's what's happening this lunchtime. It's going to be good. Hey mate, you alright? There's a lot of good churches in Sheffield and most of them are actually represented at Christian Union. Nick's my space. One of the best things with CU, quite often you have to be creative with little money and I think there's a real challenge there but a real opportunity to how you can actually be engaging people and how you can be creative with your events without having any money. So CU as a society exists, um, basically it's the only society on campus that exists for people who are its non-members, share Jesus and to, to tell people on campus who aren't part of Christian Union mm. um, about Christianity to help them explore their questions about faith. Mm. Um, Down to Foundry and then I'll be a little bit late for my lecture. Um, yeah, we've got enough, I can be 10 minutes and then I'll be... Um, so I think right. living at university, living distinctively, it doesn't mean we don't engage in everything, but it means that we um, approach everything differently. The way that we approach work, the way we approach friendships. Loads of my friends still engage in like going out to nights out. One sausage sandwich. Try and be distinctive in the way that I dress, because I like wearing different things. <laughs> Actually, distinctive living is one of the most exciting things to do. And it's not easy, like every single day is obviously, you have to sort of choose to try and live distinctively and choose to actually step out in the way that you're living. But I guess that's the most fun. Because what we hold is like very different to, to how society works. It's very different different to how people um, do normally engage with society um, so just remembering that each day is actually really exciting. Our theme is I am identity and sort of who people say they are and why they define themselves that way and then we're obviously looking at the side of who Jesus says we are and uh, how that sort of sculpts what our university life looks like. One of the things I loved what Isaac said was about FOMO and especially at university there's, there's so much like of a fear of missing out and what he said was if you're being distinctive, you're leading culture, you don't fear missing out, you actually bring people with you. Let's go.